Iga Sviantek versus Anna Karolina Shmidlova is a bronze medal match for the Olympics for 2024. And both ladies have had different roads to get to this stage. Shmidlova entered the tournament unseated and would take on Bolter in the first round. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-4-6-2. In the second round, she'd take on the 14th seed Adaj Maya. And again, no problem getting through in straights. 6-4-6-4. In the third round, she'd take on the 4th seed Paulini. And this is a battle. After dropping the second set, would fight to win in the third. 7-5-3-6-7-5. In the quarterfinal, she'd take on the number 9 seed Krajikova, who had just won Wimbledon a couple weeks ago. This is no problem getting through in straights. 6-4-6-2 to advance to the semis. In the semi-final, she'd take on Donna Vekic, number 13 seed, but unfortunately would go down in straights. 6-4-6 love, putting her in the bronze medal match. Shviontek entered the tournament as the number one seed and would take on Bagu in the first round. And after a close second set, would get through in straights. 6-2-7-5. In the second round, she'd take on Parry. This is no problem getting through in straights. 6-1-6-1. In the third round, she'd take on Wong. And after an awkward second set, would get through in straights. 6-3-6-4. In the quarterfinal, she'd take on the number eight seed Collins, who she had had trouble with in the past, including an epic in Australia at the start of the year. And after splitting the first two sets, Collins would get injured in the third, eventually retiring. 6-1-2-6-4-1 retirement, giving Sviantek a win to the semi-finals. In the semi-finals, Sviantek would take on the number six seed Jung, who just had two crazy matches against Navarro and Kerber to get to this stage. And after dropping the first set, unfortunately Sviantek would be forced into the bronze medal. 6-2-7-5 to try and play for that medal for Poland. These two have actually never played before, so this is going to be really interesting to see how the underdog Schmidlova plays against against the world number one. Of course, Sviantek has only lost a couple of matches at this venue. And Schmidlova is playing on the big stage like this for the first time, it seems, in a long time. If Schmidlova's going to win this one, she's going to play so much better than she did against Vekic. Against Vekic, she just let Vekic hit every winner all around the court. She needs to get a little bit more aggressive and be a little bit more assertive in this match if she's going to get the win over the world number one. If Schmidlova's going to win this one, she needs to limit the errors. There were so many errors against Zhang, which really hurt her chance of getting to that gold medal match and maybe the nerves as well of trying to win the gold. She wants to at least leave this tournament with a bronze medal so she's got to keep the nerves down as well if she is going to get to that bronze medal such a strange match i don't think anyone thought this was going to be the bronze medal match shviantek we all expected for gold Schmidlova, i don't think anyone expected her to be this far but i gotta go with shviantek in straight sets i reckon she'll rebound after the disappointment of losing to zhang and she'll win that bronze medal for poland but let me know in the comments below who's winning the bronze